I'm a music minister. Um, I love God and I love music, so I do gospel music. I'm also a teacher. I teach in the Niger Delta University. That's my day job, but music is what God has given to me. And I believe I have touched more lives doing music than the teaching job I do. Um, I started my music career in the year 2008 when I released my first album. It was released in Panam Music World. The album was titled Give and Praise. Um, my second album was released in the year 2012. It was titled Dare to Believe. The album was titled Dare to Believe. It was a dedication to the Archbishop of Church of God Mission, Archbishop Margaret Benson in Dahosa. I've got recent times like 14 singles I've released. I'm thinking of putting them all to get an album in the nearest future. I'm married, been married for a while and I'm loving it. The music industry, it's been sad sweet. Um, um, sweet in the sense that, you know, you're able to touch lives. Sweet in the sense that you're able to do what you love doing. But sigh in the sense that um, we lack support. We spend a lot doing our music. We spend a lot doing our videos. So it's been sad sweet, but all the same. We bless God. It has been a wonderful experience so far, and we're looking forward to better days. My inspiration is the love of God, His love, the love I have for God, and the love God has for me. That's basically my inspiration, and that's why I do gospel music. But events and activities all around they inspire me. Um, when I'm in some situations, when I'm in some places in life, they just give me a song. Like when I did Dare to Believe, I was going through some aspects, some things in certain aspects of my life. And I just believed God for it and it worked out. And so I just wrote the song Dare to Believe. And every of my, most of my songs, the inspiration have been one thing that is happening in life or the other. Things, everything around me inspires me. My next set of songs would just shock everybody who has been following my music. As a matter of fact, I'm going back to, to do our weekly songs. My next two songs will be gospel and weekly songs. So <laughs> it's like a 360 turn. So that's the project. People have always asked me, how do I combine lecturing and music? You see, the lecturing job most times people think it's one job that gives you a lot of time no you have to do the teaching you have to do um, community service and you have to do research it's very tasking but nobody has time you just have to make time for whatsoever is important for you and it's easy it's easy it's 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 not taxing and most importantly i have a very wonderful wife that does all the tidying for me. My encouragement for young people out there that are talented, pursue your dreams. If you've got a talent, try as much as possible to develop it. It is talent that feeds people these days. It might be challenging at first. It might be challenging for a long time. But if you know, if you're convinced that you're blessed with a talent. Pursue it. Do not give up. Do not throw away your talent for, for more jobs. Pursue it. One day it will pay off. <laughs>